Independence Day is almost here. In about 35 hours, thousands will pack into Point State Park for fun, food, and the annual fireworks show. And this morning, city leaders explain how they plan to keep everyone safe. KDK's Bryant Reed is at Point State Park with the details. Good morning, Bryant. Good morning, Brianna. This event is a huge summer draw in the city and it's fun and there's going to be plenty of people to try and pack in right behind me here at Point State Park to get a view of the fireworks. But Pittsburgh Public Safety says there's also going to be a lot of blue lights in the area and they say that reason is to maintain a safe and family friendly environment, which means that several branches of law enforcement like Pittsburgh Police, State Police and even Homeland Security will be on standby and roaming the streets. Public safety says more than a dozen light towers will be in place to provide a level of added security in the area. And there will also be a bag screenings when you arrive at the park. And for any drivers, streets will be closed off at a certain as at a certain point in time, so it would be best to avoid downtown if at all possible. Now keep in mind that the park will close at 9.30 p.m. because fireworks will start not long after that. And if you plan on shooting off fireworks, not at Point State Park, but at in the confinements of your own home, there are a couple of laws that you have to follow to make sure that you are doing it safely. Stick with us right here on KDKA because I'll have those and what you need to know coming up in the next half hour. Reporting this morning, I'm Brian Tree. KDK News.